My name's Guybrush Threepwood, and I want to be a pirate. Yikes! Don't sneak up on me like that. Um, I'm over this way. Ah, well then, Thriftweed. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. I see. So, you want to be a pirate, eh? You look more like a flooring inspector. But if you're serious about pirating, go talk to the pirate leaders. You'll find them in the scum bar. Gosh, thanks. I'll do that. Bye now. I'm off to seek my fortune. Good luck! Um, where did you say those pirate leaders were? The Scum Bar. Right. Thanks. Primera parte, las tres pruebas. Bien, tenemos que ir al Scum Bar o al Scum Bar y tenemos que hablar con los jefes piratas. Re-elect Governor Marley. When there's only one candidate, there's only one choice. <laughs> si solo hay un candidato, obviamente, solo hay una elección. <laughs> si solo se presenta la gobernadora para el puesto, aquí tenemos el Scumbar o el Scumbar, que por cierto, Scum es este sistema que apareció con el Mania Mansion 1 y facilitó muchísimo las aventuras gráficas antes de esto era un rollo bueno eran aventuras conversacionales y esta es la versión 5 que eh, aparece no solo aparecen la, las acciones que podemos realizar sino que aparecen los objetos aquí en forma de dibujo en las primeras versiones estaban eh, las acciones y después estaban los objetos en forma de texto y aquí están los dibujos. Otra cosa de la versión 5 es que cuando pongo el cursor encima de un objeto, si veis que se ilumina la palabra abrir, es porque, eh, a ver, el, se ilumina la acción más probable que hagas con ese objeto. En, la, en el caso de la puerta, como está cerrada, la opción más probable sería abrir. Así que si le doy al botón derecho, se abre la puerta. Te ahorra el tener que poner abrir puerta. Vamos a entrar en el bar. Vale, vamos a hablar con este pirata. Hoy there, stranger. New in town. My name's Guybrush Streetwood. I'm new in town. Guy Brush Threepwood? <laughs> That's the stupidest name I've ever heard. Vale, y bien, ¿cuál es tu nombre? A ver cómo well, se llama. What's your name? My name is Mancom Seapwood. So, what brings you to Melee Island, anyway? I've come seeking my fortune. Oh, you yeah. have? You should go talk to the important looking pirates in the next room. They're pretty much in charge around here. They can tell you where to go and what to do. Vale, ya sabemos que los jefes piratas están en la otra sala. Y la gobernadora. Governor. Governor Marley. Her mansion is on the other side of town. But pirates aren't as welcome around her place as they used to be. Why not? Well, the last time she had a pirate over for dinner, he fell in love with her. It's made things rather uncomfortable for everybody. How's that? Well, there's a whole big story about what happened next. But I don't believe a word. Esteban, over there at the other table, might tell you about it. He takes the whole thing seriously. Very seriously. Uh oh, looks like my grog is going flat. So you'll have to excuse me. Nice talking to you. Have fun on Melee Island. Vale, vamos a hablar con 
Esteban o Esteban, como le llaman aquí, que es este que está aquí, pero vamos a hablar antes con este pirata. What are you looking at me for? I'd like to introduce myself. My name's Guybrush. Yeah. So what? <laughs> Le da igual. Excuse me, but I'm looking for the Dark Bird. Dark Bird? You don't have one. There was a horrible accident. Drinking the darts don't mix. Ya sabemos lo que le pasó al ojo. ¿Por qué le falta un ojo? What happened to your eye? Well, I was putting in my contact lens, but... Hey, wait a second. That is none of your business. Who is this pirate that's bugging the governor? The Chaka. He is the guy that went to the governor's for dinner and never wanted to leave. He fell for her in a big way, but she told him to drop dead. So he did, and then things really got up. What's so scary about this LeChuck guy? LeChuck was a fierce pirate. He tried to impress the governor by sailing off to find the secret on the island. But a mysterious storm came up and sank his ship. We thought that that was the end of the fearsome pirate. We joke. We were wrong. Your cara que pone. What happened then? He still sails the waters between here and Monkey Island. His ghost ship is an unholy terror upon the sea. That is why we are all in here and not out pirating. Where can I get a drink? A drink? You can wait for the cook to notice you. But that would take all day. Just find the mug and sneak into the kitchen. That is what we all do. Look, uh, this whole lechop thing has me pretty shaken up. So, uh, if you don't mind. Well, this is Esteban. Vamos a hablar con este. Vamos a que nos cuente algo sobre Loom. So, tell me about Loom. You mean the latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure with an interface of magic. Stunning, high-resolution 3D landscapes, sophisticated score and musical effects, not to mention the detailed animation and special effects, elegant point-and-click control of characters, objects and magic. Spells <laughs> beat the rush. Go out and buy Loom today. Qué pena que el Loom eh, solo fuera la, solo hicieron la primera parte. Se suponía que iba a ser una trilogía, pero bueno, no tuvo éxito. Nice y solo hicieron la primera parte. Vamos a hablar con el perro para reírnos un rato. No le gusta el chac. <risa> la gobernadora sí le gusta. Vamos a hablar con los jefes piratas. What be ye but, boy? Oh, boy, I'm gonna I mean to kill you all. I'll get lost, boy, you bother us. 
what be a water boy. A ver, quiero ser un pirata. I'm gonna be a pirate. So what? My mother ass. Hey, don't forget we're short on help because of this whole leg chuck thing. So, so no pirates means no swag, and no swag means no grog, and we're getting dangerously low on grog. Hmm. Do you have any special skills? I can hold my breath for ten minutes. Puedo aguantar diez minutos sin respirar. All right, but you don't become a pirate just by asking. You have to go through the three trials. Uh, what three trials are those? There are three trials every pirate must pass. You must master the sword and the art of thievery and the quest. The what? Treasure hunting is here. Right! You must prove yourself in each of these three areas. Sword play, thievery, and the, the treasure huntery. And return with proof that you've done it. And then you must drink grog with us. Grog! <laughs> grog. Vale, vamos a saber en qué consisten las tres pruebas. Tell me more about mastering the source. First, get here, your sword. You must seek out and defeat the sword master. Someone in town can probably direct you. Oh, you want to find somebody to train you first. <laughs> Imagine trying to take on a sword master without any training. <laughs> Pues tenemos que conseguir una espada, entrenarlo y vencer a la maestra de la espada. Tell me more about mastering the art of thievery. We want you to procure a small item for us. The idol of many hands. In the governor's mansion. The governor keeps the idol of many hands in a display case in the mansion outside the town. You'll have to get past the guards, Patrick. The tricky part will be getting past the dogs outside. Hey, they're a particularly vicious. They might be able to drug him or something. Mm, hay que robarlo. Usted hay que robar el ídolo de múltiples brazos que tiene la gobernadora en su casa. Y hay que drogar a los perros que están vigilando la casa. Y lo último es buscar el tesoro. Tell me more about treasure hunting. Legend has it that there's a treasure buried here on the island. All you must do is find the legendary lost treasure of me and bring it back. Should I have a map or something? Well, you can hardly expect to find a treasure without a map. And don't forget, X marks the spot! Vamos a ver lo que lleva el grog este. Grog stuff anyway. Grog is a secret mixture which contains one or more of the following: kerosene, propylene glycol, artificial sweeteners, sulfuric acid, rum, acetone, red dye number two, scum, axle grease, battery acid. Or pepperoni, as you can probably imagine. It's one of the most caustic, volatile substances. No demand. The stuff eats right through these mugs, and the cook is losing a fortune replacing them. <laughs> Leave us to our grog. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. Ya sabemos cómo hacer las tres pruebas. Hey, you can't come back here. Vamos a esperar a que el tabernero salga de de la cocina. Ahí viene. 
Y nos vamos a colar en la cocina. No, no cierres la puerta. Vale, ¿qué tenemos por aquí? Un cacho de carne. It's some sort of meat or meat -like o algo parecido. Que nos lo vamos a llevar. I think it's full of that foul stuff pirates drink. Está lleno de grog. Tenemos una cacerola. Someone cooked a head cheese in this. Que también nos la llevamos. It's boiling hot. Y aquí hay un pescado que I think it's a herring. Un arenque. I think that bird will peck my hand off. Vale, el pájaro no me deja coger el arenque, pero si me voy aquí... Cada vez tarda más en bajar. Y ya está, tenemos el arenque. Bueno, aquí podemos... Usar la carne con el estofado. ¡Au! ¡Got it! Y me quedo con, con la carne ya estofada. Bien, vamos al pueblo. Meanwhile, deep beneath Monkey Island. The ghost pirate LeChuck ship lies anchored in a river of lava. Captain LeChuck, sir. I... Ah, there's nothing like the hot winds of hell blowing in your face. No, sir. Nothing like it. Ah, <laughs> uh, sir. I... It's days like this that make you glad to be dead. Oh, yes, sir. Glad to be dead. <laughs> you are glad to be dead, right? Oh, yes, sir. I, I feel so lucky that you happened to capture my ship and murdered me and everyone on the earth. <laughs> yes, yes, sir. Lucky. Glad to hear it. Now, what was it you disturbed me for? Uh, y yes, sir. Well, you see, we might have a problem on Melee Island. Problem? What possible problem could there be? I've got those sissy pirates so scared of the sea, they're afraid to take a bath. Well, there seems to be a new pirate in town. Actually, he's a pirate wannabe. Young. Inexperienced. Probably nothing to worry about. Don't know why I bother you with it. <laughs> I can take care of myself. Wait! I'll handle this personally. My plans are too important to be messed up by amateurs. Yes, sir. Bueno, eh, no tiene sentido si Kaibras es nuevo. Y un experto no tiene ningún sentido ni que Lechak se, se ocupe de él, ni que el otro le diga nada. Simplemente es un, un pirata nuevo. Vamos a hablar con el ciudadano. Excuse me, but do you have a cousin named Sven? No, pero una vez tuve un barbero llamado Dominique. Close enough. Me parece bastante. You want to buy a map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island? Only one in existence. Sí, solo existe uno. <laughs> rare. Very rare. Only 100 pieces of eight. Vale, no tengo dinero. I don't have enough money. Nos hace falta dinero. Well then, buzz off, kid. It's bad for business. Ya sabemos dónde está el mapa que necesitamos para conseguir el tesoro. Mm, vamos a ver. Eh, 
¿Cómo puedes estar al lado de esta limaña? Se ha contestado la rata. Let's saute him now. I think you'd best leave, boy. <risa> hey, don't mess with my rat. Vale, vamos a ver a esta puerta. Uh, I think I hear slithering inside. Gee, I wonder what's in these baskets. Actually, I'm not that curious to find out what's inside. <laughs> no quiere. Probably poisonous snakes. Vamos a abrir el baúl. No thanks. No. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. Maybe no one miss just this one thing. Me llevo el pollo. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Es un pollo de goma con una polea en el centro. What may I help you with, son? <laughs> Me llevo Gaiba Zipcot y soy un malvado pirata. Wait. Don't say anything. I can sense your name is is Guybrush. Guybrush nose hair. No. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Am I not right? Vaya, es sorprendente. Wow, that was amazing. <laughs> do you know any other tricks? I do not deal in tricks. What I know is the truth. ¿Cuánto quieres por este pollo tan chulo? I sense the guilt of stealing my chicken grows. Take it. It's you. Ah, me lo regala. Why don't you want it? Is it jinxed with an ancient voodoo curse? No, no. The pulley squeaks. <laughs> Chirria la, la polea. So, my mind reading skills tell me it is your future you are interested in. Are you certain this is something you really wish to know? Yes, tell me everything that's going to happen to me. I am getting a vision. I see you taking a voyage. A long voyage. I see you captaining a ship. Yeah! I see... What? See what? I see a giant monkey. Yikes! I see you inside the giant monkey. Oh, gross. Wait. It's all becoming clear. Your journey will have many parts. You will see things better left unseen. You will hear things better left unheard. You will learn things better left unlearned. What kind of things? I hate surprises. No. The time is not bright to know. When you know your purpose, come see me. I will let you know then. Yikes! Vale, pero tenemos el pollo de goma, que es lo que nos interesa. Ahoy. Alguien nos está llamando aquí. Vamos al callejón. Hello. Anybody in here? Hello. You know, bad things could happen to a person in a dark, deserted alley like this one, and at this time of night, nobody would be around to see it. Did you hear something back in here too? No. I'd better get your name. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I'm a mighty pirate. Listen, Peepwood. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. 
or whatever your name is, listen. I'm the sheriff around here. Sheriff Fester Shinetop. Take it from me. This is a bad time to be visiting Melee Island. A very bad time. My advice to you is to find somewhere else to take your vacation. Somewhere safer. Boy, I feel much better knowing there's an officer of the law around. Bueno, el que me llamó no está por aquí. El cartel. Oh, a circus. I love a circus. Bueno, ahora sí, vamos a la tienda. Ahoy there, fancy pants. Vale, aquí hay una espada. When you want a sword as sharp as your wit. Y aquí tenemos una pala que también nos hace falta. What do you think? This? What do you want? Vale, y el tendero nos va a llevar hasta la maestra de la espada. Okay. Wake me up if you need anything. Pero antes necesitamos dinero. Necesitamos doblones. Esta es la iglesia y la cárcel. You gotta get me out of here. I'm a victim of society. Not to mention halitosis. <laughs> hey, it's hard to keep my breath minty fresh when there's nothing to eat in here but rats. Vale, sabemos que hay un prisionero y hay una rata en la otra celda. Y aquí está la mansión de la gobernadora Marley. Y estos son los caniches pira pirañas asesinos, que antes nos decían que teníamos que dormirlos. Y ese... Ah, entran y salen al azar. Vale, pues a buscar dinero. Vale, tenemos el mapa de Melea Island. Aquí hay unas luces, una esplanada, aquí no hay nada, y aquí hay una isla y una casa. Vamos a ir primero a la esplanada. Y este es el circo que vimos antes en el cartel. I think there's something going on in there. I get in the cannon, but the gunpowder makes me sneeze. Well, I can't do it. I hurt my hand him in the lions last week. I hardly think that little scratch compares to my chronic allergy. You get in the cannon. You don't have any allergies, you faker. You get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. Slacker. Loser. Raphael. Stop. Weasel. Weasel. Mix vendiendo estas maravillosas chaquetas. Esto de Indiana Jones. Fine, Jack. Say there, son. How do you like the chance? A once in a lifetime chance. To perform an amazing feat. 
Är detta pengar fint? Well, not so deathly fine, really. Uh, danger is a feed. No, not dangerous at all. An easy feed. But exciting. With the amazing. Adventurous. Acrobatic. And exceedingly well known. Fabulous. Flying. Perugini brothers. That's us. My brother Alfredo. My brother Bill. That sound good? Good. It's a very simple, really. See that cannon over there? All you have to do is a get in the cannon and we'll shoot you out of it. Across the room. Quite safe, actually. So, what do you say? No tiene peligro, dice. ¿Y cuánto me vas a pagar? De aquí sacamos el dinero. How about 478 pieces of eight? Vale, me parece bien. Sounds good. Have you got a helmet? Claro que tengo casco. Of course I have a helmet. What sort of idiot do you take me for? Well, let's have it. We want to be sure. That it's safe. Wouldn't want you hurt. No salir. Le vamos a dar la cacerola como casco. Ah, that will work as a helmet. Now we can do the trick. Step right over here, son. Now put on your helmet and get in the cannon, and we'll take care of the rest. Echo. Hala. Y no hay peligro. <laughs> Según oh, ellos no hay peligro. So hey. Are you okay? <laughs> Están las letras al revés. Where's my helmet? Is all right. Hooray! We are spared an embarrassing and financially debilitating lawsuit. Here is your money, sir. Just the recompense for aiding us. The basic theory is fine. We just need to change the aim a bit. I'll try it next. No, I'll do it next. No, me! No, me! Slacker! Loser! Ruffian! Fuck! Vale, ya tenemos dinero. 478 doblones. Con esto podemos comprar la espada. Podemos comprar eh, la pala. Y podemos comprar el mapa. Vale, alguna de estas puertas... A ver... Ahí está. Son atajos. Ahoy there, fancy pants. Vale, vamos a llevarnos la espada y vamos a llevarnos la pala. Are you waiting for me to fall asleep? What do you want? Me vendría muy bien un caramelo de menta. Breath mint. Whew, you're telling me. Here, take one, please. Take the whole roll. That'll be one piece of eight. What else do you want? About this sword. La espada. Yeah, what about it? How much is it? That's a hundred pieces of eight. Take it. Or leave. I'll take it. Great. Best hundred pieces of eight you ever spent. What else do you want? Vale, quiero la pala. 
Yeah, what about it? I want it. Great. Oh, it'll pay for itself, believe me. Yeah, you'll dig up 75 pieces of eight in no time. But hey, save some treasure for the rest of us, would you? <laughs> what else do you want? Nada más. I think I'd just like to... Por ahora nada más. Whatever. Vale, los caramelos... Le podemos dar uno al prisionero que tenía litosis. Oh, Crackle Mint. How refreshing. Thanks. So, have you come to release me? Who are you? My name is Ores. At least I think it is. I've been in here so long I can hardly remember. You gotta get me out of here before I lose my mind completely. Can't you see? I'm innocent. But why are you in jail if you're innocent? I was framed. I didn't touch the stupid flowers. Get flores. What flowers? The yellow conish in dormi flowers in the forest. It's against the law to pick them. Te puedo traer algo? Yes. You can get me out of here. Actually, something to get rid of these rats would be nice. I'll trade you this carrot cake my aunt Tilly made. I hate carrot cake. Vale, tengo que traerle algo para deshacerse de las ratas. Keep a stiff upper lip. I gotta go. Thanks a lot. Y a cambio me dará un pastel. Y además me ha dicho... Bueno, no sé si lo puedo repetir. Ah, no lo va a repetir otra vez. Well, keep a stiff upper lip. I gotta go. Thanks a lot. Ha dicho que eh, había unas flores, lo de las flores, que se llamaban algo así como... Eh, ay, no me acuerdo cómo se llamaba exactamente, pero algo así como caniche dormilus o algo así. Vamos, que esas flores sirven para dormir caniches. Esas son las flores que vamos a tener que usar para dárselos a los caniches que están en la, en la mansión de la gobernadora. ¿Cuál es la puerta que va al otro lado? Esa vale. Vale, pues también podría comprarle la eh, el mapa. Now it's only you again. Come back for the map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island, huh? I hope you brought enough money this time. Me lo llevo. Take it. It'll make a swell gift. There you go. You made a wise decision. Now get lost. Vale, ya tengo una espada, pero necesito un entrenador primero. Antes de intentar vencer a, eh, a la maestra de la espada, necesito un entrenador. Vale, vamos a ir aquí a las luces. No, al puente primero. Stop. You must pay a toll. Un duende dice, mm, pero creía que eran los trolls los que, los que protegían los puentes y había que darle un, un peaje para pasar. How much is the toll? Well, what have you got? No te metas conmigo. Soy un malvado pirata. Troll. I'm a mighty pirate. <laughs> You're no pirate. 
while the town drunk could out insult you on his back. And probably would. Vale, insulto I mejor can que nadie. insult anybody, you brainless clay doppelganger. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. Take that and stick it in your repertoire. None shall pass. Necesito darle algo para que me deje pasar. Vamos a darle None shall pass. el pescado. A red herring. Pass. Vale, ya podemos llegar a las luces. Welcome to Stan's previously owned vessels. I'm off searching the globe right now for the finest in previously owned marine transportation. Have a look around. I'll be right back. Stan. Vale, aquí es donde tengo que venir para comprar un barco cuando lo necesite, cuando quiera salir de la isla. Grog. Diet Grog. Cherry Grog. Grog Classic. Caffeine Free Grog. And Root Beer. Cerveza de Raiz. There must be a more honest way to get some spare change. <laughs> Captain Smirk's Big Body Pirate Gym. Prices. Sword training, 30 pieces of weight. Cannon firing, 160 pieces of weight. Balls extra. Grappling hook, 130 pieces of weight. Hook extra. Lucha con Garfio. <laughs> vale, este es nuestro entrenador. I think I'll knock. It'd only be polite. What do you want, you wimpy little spineless maggot? Could you train me to be better than the Swordmaster? Better than the Swordmaster? You? <laughs> you could never be half the sword fighter Carly is. Even with hours of hard work and sweat and blood. I remember fighting side by side with Carla at Port Royal. The local constabulary had us cornered. It looked like we were done for, but then she said, but I digress. You just don't have what it takes. I just don't have what it takes. You do not. I do so. You do not. I do so. I like your spirit. I'll do what I can. Of course, it'll cost you. What do you got? Vale, tengo los 30 doblones. Creía que lo haría gratis, vamos a decirle eso. Well, you figured wrong. <laughs> Creíste mal. What else have you got? Bueno, le vamos a dar los 30 doblones. Solo tengo este pollo muerto. This isn't one of those rubber chickens with a pulley in the middle, is it? I've already got one. What else have you got? Los 30 I've got 30 pieces of eight. Say no more, say no more. Let's see your sword. Okay, check it out. Yes, this is a nice one. Let's get to it. Okay, you maggot. Why don't you whip that sword out and let's see what you can do with it. Boy, you fight like a dairy farmer. I usually don't waste my time with vermin like yourself. But seeing as this LeChuck thing has put a cramp on business, I got no choice. I need the money. Yes. 
I can see this is gonna take some special measures. Just want you to know, I don't do this with everyone. It's only because I feel that special student-mentor pieces of eight bonding that I'm going to these lengths. I'm gonna put you up against the machine. Machine? Is this gonna hurt? Yikes. Come at me. Don't be afraid, you won't hurt me. No! Beat first, then lunge! No! Beat first, then lunge! Advance, thrust, recover, parry, repulse! Watch your footwork. Hours later. You're starting to get the hang of it. More hours later. Not bad. You've got good form. Now I'm gonna let you in on the true secret of sword fighting. Sword fighting is kinda like making love. It's not always what you do, but what you say. Any fool pirate can swing a sharp piece of metal around and hope to cut something. But the pros... They know just when to cut their opponent with an insult. One that catches them off guard. You see, kid, your wit's got to be twice as sharp as your sword. Let's try a couple of insults out, shall we? Okay. Imagine this. We're fighting up a storm. Just like Carla and I were doing at Port Royal. There's a sudden break in the fighting, and I say to you, You fight like a dairy farmer. You respond with... Vale, ya empezamos a aprender insultos y ahora necesitamos aprender las respuestas correctas para cada insulto. Y claro, no nos sabemos ninguno. Por cierto, creo que en los juegos antiguos no decían tú luchas con un ganadero. Creo que decía tú luchas como un granjero, me parece. Creo que lo han cambiado. So is your mother. I can see we've got a lot of work to do here. You should have responded with something like, How appropriate! You fight like a cow! You see, it's razor-sharp wit like that that wins fights. Let's try another. Imagine this. You're trapped up against a wall. My sword just slashed two cuts into your face. I say, Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. You respond with? Mira, ya tenemos una respuesta, pero claro, no es para este insulto. Ya sabemos un insulto y su respuesta. I am rubber, you are glue. I can see we're in deep trouble here. Ah. Oh, a correct response to Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Would have been something like... First, you better stop waving it around like a feather duster. See? Razor sharp. Now, I suggest you go out there and learn some insults. I can't help but feel like I've been ripped off. I'm sure you're feeling something similar. Ahora tenemos que ir y aprender insultos. Todos los que pueda y su respuesta y por eso tenemos aquí a todos estos piratas no ahí no stopping a pirate can be dangerous to your health Ha llegado tu hora. Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Vale, ¿cuántas me solo me sé dos? Bueno, me sé de esta la de una vez tuve un perro más listo que tú. Esta no sé de dónde la has sacado. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. First, you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. Te sabe la respuesta, así que voy perdiendo ahora. You have the manners of a beggar. Vale, nuevo insulto. Ya he aprendido un insulto nuevo. Oh, yeah?
I got this scar on my face. Otro insulto During nuevo. A mighty struggle. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. I give up. You win. Stopping a pirate can be dangerous to your health. Nice night we're having, isn't it? I sure hope you had something more important to stop me for. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Vale, tengo uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Vamos a, a ver. Este me sé la respuesta. La del ganadero también. Así que vamos a ponerle la del mendigo a ver si se sabe la respuesta. You have the manners of a beggar. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable Bien. with me. Ya tengo la respuesta. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Eh, no, esta no me la sé. I am rubber, you are glue. You have the manners of a beggar. Eh, este sí, me lo acabo de decir. Eh, esto, quería asegurarme de que estuvieras a gusto conmigo. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. A ver, ¿cuál no me sé? La de la cicatriz. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Oh, yeah. Ah, y él tampoco se sabe la respuesta. Vale, y la del perro más listo que tú tampoco la sé. Dog that was smarter than you. Oh, yeah. Tampoco se la sabe. Mira, le gané. I give up. You win. Este no era muy... No se sabía mucho... Muchos insultos. Lo vemos con otro. What you be wanting, you scurvy lubber? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Vale, a ver, eh, la del perro no me la sé. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. I am rubber, you are y el, blue. Y él tampoco. Eh, este sí me la sé. La de la cicatriz. I got on my face during a mighty struggle. I hope now you've learned to stop bien, picking your nose. Bien, ya me sé otra respuesta. You're no match for my brains, you Y una nueva, fool. un nuevo insulto. Nuevo insulto que no me sé. I am rubber, you are glue. You fight like a dairy farmer. Este sí me lo sé. Eh, qué apropiado tú peleas como una vaca. You fight like a cow. Vale, eh, 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 eh. La de la sangre. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. So, you got that job as a janitor after all. Y perdí, pero he aprendido algunos, algunos insultos y algunas respuestas. Ay, this better be important. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Mm, a ver, la de la sangre no es la que faltaba. Y la de demasiado bobo para mi nivel de inteligencia. Esa tampoco me la sé. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Oh yeah. Y él tampoco. Y a ver. Esta me la sé. La de la sangre sí que me la sé. La del perro. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. He must have taught you everything you perfecto. know. You make me want to puke. Esta es nueva. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. You fight like a dairy farmer. Vale, eh... How appropriate! You fight like a cow!
¿Cuál era la que no me sabía? Esta. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Oh yeah. I give up. You win. I guess it is. What you be wanting, you scurvy lover? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. You make me want to puke. You make me think somebody already did. Bien. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. No, no me says. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. I've heard you were a contemptible. Este también es nuevo. Y no me lo sé. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. Where bueno, did eh? my sword go? Stopping a pirate can be dangerous to your health. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. So, you got that job as Janet? Ah, sí, este sí me lo sabía. La del barrendero, es verdad. You make me want to puke. Y este también me lo sé. Esto me hace pensar que alguien ya lo ha hecho. You make me think somebody already did. Y la de la cicatriz era lo de tocarse la nariz, me parece. Ah, lo del soplón. A ver, ¿cuál faltaba? He hablado con simios más educados que tú. Creo que esta era nueva. Apes more polite than you. I'm shaking, I'm shaking. No se lo sabe. Eh, y demasiado bobo para mi nivel de inteligencia tampoco me lo sé. My brains, you poor fool. I'd be in real trouble if you ever use them. No. Ah, pues sí. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Primero debería de dejar usarla como un plumero. First you better stop waving it like a feather duster. Wow. You're good enough to fight the Swordmaster. Mm, no lo creo. Todavía no. Vamos a aprender algunos más. Move out of the way, or I cut me way through. Vamos a aprender algunos más. My name más. is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. A ver, ¿cuál es el que no me sé? I've spoken with apes more polite than you. I am rubber. You are glue. Y este tampoco. O el del soplón. Ay, ya no me acuerdo. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. Ah, este sí me lo sabía. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. Esta era... Esta la de la nariz. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. No, no era esta. You make me want to puke. Esta es. Uh... Me hace pensar que alguien ya you lo ha hecho. You make me think somebody already did. I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. I am rubber. You are glue. 
Wow, you're good enough to fight the sword, master. Ya me están diciendo que podría intentarlo con Carla, pero yo Stop creo que todavía falta aprender algunos más. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. Oh yeah? You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Esta es la del barrendero. Ay, no me acuerdo. So you got that job as a janitor after all. No. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. Sí, es así. I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. Ese es nuevo, mira, por fin. Creo que ya me lo sé todo. Yikes, nice move. Al menos todos los que todo lo que he aprendido me sé las respuestas. Ay, Vamos a intentarlo una vez más a ver si hay algún insulto nuevo. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Oh, yeah? You make me want to puke. Eh, hey, a ver. Me hace pensar que alguien ya lo ha hecho. Claro, es que no le puedo... No le puedo decir el insulto que acabo de aprender, no se lo puedo decir ahora. Tengo que esperar a la siguiente. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. Yikes, nice move. Vale, pues he aprendido un insulto nuevo y haré que aprender la respuesta correcta. What you be wanting, you scurvy lubber? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. A ver dónde está el nuevo insulto. Este. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Even before they smell your breath. <laughs> You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Esta es... Estaría acabado si la usases alguna vez. trouble if you ever use them. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me and nobody ever will. I am rubber. You are glue. Ah, no se lo sabe. You make me want to puke. You make me think somebody already did. 
people fall at my feet when they see me coming. Vale, este sí me lo sé. Ah, no lo, claro, como lo aprendió aquí, no, no lo entiendo. No debería. Debería aparecer. Ah, no, está aquí. Incluso antes. Ahí está. Debería aparecer, claro. Wow, you're good enough to fight the sword, master. Vale, probamos con Carla. Vamos a probar. Primero tenemos que averiguar de dónde vive. Vamos al tendero. Ring bell for service. It never fails. A step away from the counter for two seconds and some idiot's already ringing that stupid bell. What do you want? Vale, vamos a preguntarle. Estoy buscando a la maestra de la espada. I'm looking for the swordmaster of Melee Island. The swordmaster of Melee Island? Hmm. Now, I don't know. See, nobody knows the whereabouts of her secret hideout. Nobody except me. I'd have to go and ask her if it's okay to show you the way. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Once. I'll be right back. And don't touch anything! Vale, vamos a seguirle. Y así sabemos dónde, dónde vive. Vale, es este. Y se mete en el cruce y hay que seguirlo. Vale, y aquí, ya que estamos aquí, recuerda las plantas amarillas que dormían a los caniches, pues son estas plantas. Así que vamos a recogerlas. I better just stay back here and eavesdrop. Hello again, Carla. I thought I told you to get lost. Actually, I'm here on uh, business. This kid come into my store, see? Face it, you crusty old lech. You'd make any excuse just to come out here and bother me. Yeah, I guess so. Well, cut it out. I'm sick of it. Take a hike and don't come out here again. Someone might follow you, and then I'd become another Melee Island tourist attraction. Hey, it's your loss, baby. Yeah, right. Now scram. I'm back, and boy, are you in trouble this time. Let's get this over with.
I will milk every drop of blood from your body. Vale, vamos a ver. Esto podría ser lo de la nariz. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. No, no es. My sword is famous all over the Caribbean. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. Es así. No one will ever catch me fighting as badly as you do. Esta no la tengo. No, esta no la tengo. I am rubber, you are glue. My name is feared in every dirty corner of this island. Esto es lo del barrendero. So you got that job as a janitor after all. I usually see people like you passed out on tavern floors. Arrastrándose por los bares. No lo sé, quizá la del aliento. Even before they smell your breath? My wisest enemies run away at the first sight of me. Mis enemigos más sabios corren al verme llegar. Te habré enseñado todo lo que sabes, puede ser, no sé. Ah, no sé. He must have taught you everything you know? No. Only once have I met such a coward. Esto te habré este sí, te habré enseñado He todo lo que sabes. He must have taught you everything you know. Every word you say to me is stupid. Cada palabra que sale de tu boca es una estupidez. Quería asegurarme de que estuvieras a gusto conmigo. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. Y gané. I give up. You win. Well, I hope you're happy. You can go back and brag to all your friends about how you beat the Swordmaster. You'll need proof. Here. This should convince them. Vale, ya tenemos una de las tres pruebas. Hemos ganado a la maestra de la espada. ¿Podemos irnos por aquí o no? No. Vale, ahora que tenemos ya eh, los pétalos amarillos, si usamos los pétalos... Bueno, lo usamos después. Primero vamos a ir a, a robar el, el ídolo de múltiples brazos a, a la mansión de la gobernadora. Vale, tenemos que librarnos de los caniches y sabemos que las flores amarillas dormían a los caniches, así que usamos las flores con el estofado y le damos la carne a los caniches.
Important notice. These dogs are not dead. They are only sleeping. No animals were harmed during the production of this game. Vale, queda claro. No están muertos, solo están dormidos. They're sleeping peacefully. This looks like a job for Fester Shine Top. El sheriff. the red button. It's a big, ugly, hairy yak wearing some wax lips. I can't move it. I can't move it. Y un, quita, un quita grapa. I'll need this. I must be nuts. <laughs> Tenemos los labios de cera. ¡Hack! ¡Gophers! Y un repelente de ardilla. It's beautiful. Ahí está el ídolo. I can't open it. Uh oh. That should hold him for a while. If only I had a file, I could get the idol. Vale, me hace falta una lima. Y tenemos un montón de objetos nuevos porque sí. It says, I beat the Swordmaster. I think it's some kind of religious text. Labio de cera y repelente de ardilla. Vamos a darle el repelente al que está en la cárcel. A ver si sirve como repelente de ratas. Hey, this is my work on the rats. Thanks. Here's the cake. Vale, tenemos un pastel. It's heavy. Y dentro del pastel había una lima. O sea, si este se hubiera comido el pastel, hubiera tenido una lima y hubiera podido escapar. Bueno, podríamos intentar usar la lima con la cerradura. I better not wear it out before I get the idol. Claro. Pero no quiere. El sheriff todavía sigue ahí, así que... I've got the file.
Wee! Vale, tenemos el ídolo. Ahí está el ídolo de múltiples brazos, pero no veo que tenga ningún brazo. Whew. That was a close one. At least I got the idol. But I'm not done with you yet. Uh oh. Thought you could get out of here with the idol of many hands, did you? Look, I can explain. So can I. You poisoned the governor's pet poodles. They're just sleeping. Broke into her house. The door was unlocked. And stole one of her most valuable pieces of art. No, you've got it all wrong. Oh, really? Well, let's hear your explanation. <laughs> ¿Qué le digo? Pertenece a un museo. Otra cosa de Indiana Jones. Belongs in a museum. What's going on here? Ahí está la gobernadora. This hoodlum making off with your idol, governor. He says it belongs in a museum. That's right. It does. What? You heard me, Festa. The real question is, how did he get in here while you were on guard? I uh. Oh, just go away, Festa. I can handle this. Hmm. I'll deal with you later. Sorry about him. He's new. I'm Governor Marley. Governor Elaine Marley. So my idol belongs in a museum, eh? Hmm. Esto. Relax, Mr. Threepwood. I know why you're here. Believe me, you're not the first who's tried. Although I have to admit, not many get as far as you have. Golly! My lookout told me of your arrival. I've wanted to meet you ever since I heard your fascinating name. Tell me, Guybrush, why do you want to be a pirate? You don't look like one. Your face is too... sweet. Girl... I see. Well, you're obviously not in the mood for idle chit-chat, are you? I suppose you've got many more exciting things to do? I won't take up any more of your time, Mr. Threepwood. Mm. <laughs> Uh, I really wish I knew how to talk to women. Sí, sigo teniendo el ídolo. Vale. Ya tengo dos cosas. Where do you uh, think you're going, thump wind? You know, it's not too late for us to make up and be friends. Yeah. And it's also not too late for me to kill you and still make it to the bar for happy hour. Hand over your sword. Uh-oh. This is the end of the road, my little pantalooned pal. Your troublemaking days on Melee Island are over. My plans for the governor are far too important and much too near completion to risk letting a would-be pirate like you get in the way. So long, Mr. Spice Cake or Droop Face or whatever your name is. Hmm. This might know, actually what? turn out to be a pretty good day. Bueno, ahora nos viene bien lo que dijo al principio de que puede respirar durante 10 minutos bajo el agua. Puedo aguantar la respiración durante 10 minutos. Y aquí está el lío. Todo el mundo, al principio, cuando empieza, todo el mundo intenta cortarlo con todo esto. Y para eso está, para despistar. Intentas cortarlo, no, no llega, no llega, no llega a ningún sitio. Hasta que te das cuenta de que... 
y te llevas el ídolo, <ríe> ya puedes salir. Que es tan sencillo And como eso. Ah, claro, se llevó la espada. Ya tenemos una nueva. Well, that wasn't so hard. Now all I have to do is show this stupid idol to the pirate leaders and... You're alive! Governor! Hey, you can talk. <laughs> Who'd have known? What are you doing here? Come to finish the job? No, I came down here to save your life. Fester wasn't acting on my orders when he threw you in there. Uh, you came down here to rescue me? I, I didn't even think you liked me. Well, our first meeting was a little awkward. You seemed to have trouble forming complete sentences. But then again, so do most of my citizens. But I'm not one of your citizens. I'm just a drifter. A nobody. A would-be pirate. Who would have known or even cared if you'd let me drown? I would have, Guybrush. Oh, Governor. Oh, Threepwood. Oh, Elaine. Oh, Guybrush. Love Muffin. Sugar Boots. Honey Pumpkin. Plunder Bunny. Kiss me. No. We mustn't. What? Not here, where everyone can see us. Why? Are you ashamed of me? No, no, it's not that at all. It's just that many of these pirates have made advances towards me. And to avoid hurting their feelings, I've always told them that my father made me promise never to fall in love with a pirate. If they see us together, they'll know I was lying. Okay, then. Let's go to your place. Okay. But finish your trials first. I don't want you to be preoccupied. But I feel this sudden urge to complete the trials quickly. Tenemos mucha prisa ahora. Venga, vamos a terminar las tres pruebas. Lo siguiente sería el mapa. I think I've been Para encontrar el tesoro. This is no map. It looks like dancing lessons. Vale, fondo izquierda derecha, izquierda derecha, fondo derecha izquierda, fondo, vale. Esto si nos vamos otra vez al eh, don, al bosque. Aquí al cruce. Fondo izquierda derecha. Fondo izquierda derecha. Izquierda derecha fondo. Ahora izquierda. Derecha y ahora fondo. Y por último, derecha, izquierda y fondo. Y aquí es donde está el tesoro. The legendary lost treasure of Melee Island. This carefully reproduced piece of Melee Island history has delighted thousands of would-be pirates and their families for generations. Remember, there are other pirates on this island. So go easy on the treasure. <laughs> no coja mucho del tesoro. Deja algo para el próximo. Vamos a usar la pala con la X que marca el lugar, que ya no lo dijo el jefe pirata. No, this shouldn't take too long. Hours pass. Hey, I think I hit something. Oh boy! 
It's a t-shirt! <laughs> Not my size, but a nice one nonetheless. Well, I guess I should put all this dirt back now. More hours pass. Me la he hasta la X y todo. Here lies treasure of such unimaginable wealth. Well, you'll just have to dig it up to believe it. Paid for by the Melee Island Chamber of Commerce. Vale, ahora volvamos. Ya tenemos la, las tres pruebas hechas. Ahora habrá que entregarle las pruebas a los tres jefes piratas. What was that? I'm so confused. Hey! What are you doing just standing around? The governor's been kidnapped! What? By whom? LeChuck's got her on that ship that just sailed off. I'm afraid we've seen the last of her. So where were you this whole time? Sleeping? Hey, I'm a lookout, not a bodyguard. Where did they go? LeChuck's taken the governor back to his hideout on Monkey Island. I'm afraid that no pirate on this island is brave enough to follow him there. But hey, good luck. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Uh, they left this note. You can have it, but I don't think you'll like what it says. Vale, a ver lo que dice la nota. Attention, pirates of melee. Your governor is alive and well and by my side as she was always meant to be. If you try to find us, you will only meet with horrifying disaster. Yours truly, Captain LeChuck. Pues vamos a tener que ir a Monkey Island. What's wrong, old sot? The governor is gone. LeChuck and his spectral crew came and got her. They put her in the ghost ship and spirited her away. She was so good to me. Always conveniently losing those health board reports. <laughs> For a small consideration, of course. What'll become of my business? Oh, woe is me. <laughs> what can I do to save her? You must get a ship and go after her. The ghost pirate's lair is on Monkey Island. Everybody knows that. Don't ask me how. All you need to do is find a way there. Where can I get a ship? Why, it's Smiling Stan's used shipyard. Same as everybody else. Tell him I sent you. We're old friends. Will you join me? Uh, alas, I can't <laughs> go to sea. An no kidding. Injury. Sí, sí, excusa. I'm sure you understand. <laughs> Right. I'm off. Good luck. Be sure to wear your mittens. And your galoshes. And don't forget to write. Bye now. <laughs> Vamos a intentar comprar un barco. En Stan. Ahora sí estará. I'm Stan of Stan's previously owned vessel, and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. 
What sort of craft are you looking for? Big? Little? Fast? Slow? You want it? I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I want to make you a deal that you're happy with. Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're going to leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. <laughs> so tell me, what are you interested in looking at today? Quiero ver el mejor barco que tengas. Hey, it's nice to meet a man who appreciates quality. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Now this, this is a ship fit for a king. I mean, we're talking 15 staterooms, a fireplace in every one. We're talking two pools, one indoor, one outdoor. We're talking rotating ballroom. We're talking heated crow's nest. We're talking 200 feet of ocean-going decadence. And all for one low price. Speaking of price, let's talk about money. Your money. Vale, eh, <risa> esperaba, bueno, le voy a decir primero que tengo 171 doblones, que es lo que tengo. Oh, no more than 100 odd pieces of eight. I think we must be talking about completely <risa> different ships here. You've obviously been out of the ship market for quite some time. I doubt you're carrying enough cash on you for this transaction. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? Vamos a probarlo con el pollo de goma. What this rubber chicken? Is it one of those rubber chickens with a pulley in the middle? I already got one of those. <laughs> Todo el mundo tiene uno. Other means of finance, would you? Vale, le voy a decir crédito. Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. That's just old Stan's philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. Money is no object. Well, it is with me. How much you got? On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I tell you, I got a feeling you're gonna leave here today with a new previously owned vessel. So, what else can I show you? Parece muy cara. But algo que no sea muy caro, pero que sea duradero. Too expensive, but built to last. Affordable quality. Hey, that's my motto. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Now I can see you're a no frills kind of guy, but I can also tell that quality means a lot to you. I mean, just look at the way you dress. Rugged, like this baby. She comes from a land far to the north where the sea is as unforgiving as the men are tough and hey, You wouldn't happen to be from there, would you? You just seem to have a sort of Nordic quality about you. Anyway, we're talking about a real value here. How much would you like to spend? No. Vamos a... On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Pese tampoco. Of course it isn't. You're looking for a much bigger boat, I can tell. So, what else can I show you? Hey, la school, la ver. By your office looks nice. Of course it does. It's mine. And it's not for sale. What else can I show you? Ese tampoco. Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Vamos a intentar conseguir crédito con el tendero. Get over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. I forgot to give you my card. <laughs> ¿Cómo aparece ahí? 
And here's something else to remember me by. A compass? An extra strong magnetic compass. With your picture on it. That's right. It always points directly back here. So if you're looking for a good deal, you know where to go. I'll be right here when you come back. But I can't guarantee that any of these ships will. Right. They're moving fast today. Yes, sirree. Can't hardly keep anything in stock. He'll be back. Vamos al tendero. Voy a ver una tarjeta suya y una brújula super magnética. When you set sail for good value, all winds blow towards stands. Warning. Ay, no he escuchado eso. Set sail for good value, all winds blow towards stands. Warning. Contains strong magnet which may interfere with other navigational equipment. Ahí está, eso va a ser importante más adelante. El, el, el imán que tiene la brújula. Where'd you go? I hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again. What do you want? Eh, a ver, a ver, quisiera obtener una carta de crédito. I'm interested in securing a note of credit. You are, I, uh... You got a job? Yes, of course I do. All right. I'll get one of my notes and we'll fill it out. Vale, aquí hay que fijarse, va a abrir la caja fuerte, hay que fijarse en la combinación. Let's see here. What did you say your occupation was? Le puedo decir, por ejemplo, que limpio barco. I clean ships over at Stan's used shipyard. I haven't seen a clean ship over there in <laughs> years. You're either lying or you're just a crummy worker. Either way, I don't trust you. Vale, no sé si me voy a acordar. What else do you want? Vamos a decirle que otra vez que estoy I'm buscando a la maestra para que se vaya y voy a intentar abrir la caja fuerte. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm, I guess I could hike all the way over there again. I'll be right back. And don't touch anything. Vamos a intentar abrir la caja. Ah, no, era para el otro lado. Era hacia el otro lado. No.
Hmm. Ahora sí. There's nothing in here but this note. Una nota que dice... I, the good and honorable storekeeper, do hereby take liability for the debts of the bearer of this note for any amount up to 5,000 pieces of eight. Vale, ya tenemos 5.000 doblones en crédito. Así que ahora vamos a tener que convencer a Stan para que nos venda un barco que cueste 5.000 doblones. see you again. I knew you'd come back. Everybody does. You know why they come back? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. So, what else can I show you? Vale, a ver, eh... I don't really have that much to spend. Have no fear. Every ship I sell is a bargain. But if you're looking for a real steal, I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Otra vez el barco vikingo. No, ese, ese es el correcto. This here is the famous Sea Monkey. The only ship ever to make it to Monkey Island and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Or should I say, anything. You see, the previous owners of the ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Their fate, a mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. Anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. What kind of price range were you thinking of? Will you take it? Hey, of course! Your credit's always good at stands. It doesn't matter if you've had credit problems in the past. Divorce, bankruptcy, chronic gambling mishaps. I mean, who am I to judge, right? If the storekeeper trusts you enough to give you a letter of credit, then you must be an honest man with a steady income, right? Uh, right. Let's get down to brass tack, shall we? I know you want it. You know you want it. And I know that you know that I want to sell it, so... Quanto pides por él? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away for just 10,000 de lo que tengo. How does that sound to you? A ver, eh... Hablemos de las opciones. Let's talk extras. Extras? You want to talk extras? Great! This baby's loaded with extras. For instance, did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? Creo que podré sobrevivir sin esa basura. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? Tampoco la quiero. Y así me va mm, quitando extras, me va bajando el precio. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. 
Sure, throw safety to the wind. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? Tampoco lo quiero. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it, barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course, mutiny is an ugly word. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the tachometer? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow, does your wife know you're such a cheapskate? <laughs> But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? Vale, voy a ver cuánto vale ya. Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy no, away today no, no. for just 7,300 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Eh, I'd like to pay 2,000 pieces of eight. Sure, I guess we can start out at the bottom. I got all day. I'm going to be getting a whole new shipment next week, so you got me over a barrel. I've got to sell this baby, even if it means losing my shirt. Let's talk about the options to see if I'm going to reduce the price. Can I tell you about this simulated wood siding? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated wood. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the porthole buggers? Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy away today for just 6,850 pieces of eight. Hasta que ya llegue a 5,000. No puedo, no puedo comprarlo. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Vamos a subirle a los 3,000. How does 3,000 pieces of eight sound? That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. Just tell me, what would it take to get you to sail this ship away today? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 6,350 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Okay, okay. 4,000 pieces of eight. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. You realize, don't you, that they just don't make them like this anymore? I'd like vale, to última oferta. Great! How much? All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. 5,000 pieces of eight? Okay, okay. It's killing me, but okay. And I thought I was gonna give my children Christmas presents this year. Just take it out of here. I'm glad to get rid of it. Oh yeah, do you have that note from the storekeeper on you? Thanks. I've got to run these numbers by my boss. He'll think I'm nuts, but I'll talk him into it. You meet me at the dock with your crew. I'll bring the ship and the papers. I just want to say that I really feel like we got to know each other today. I mean, I really felt some bonding here. And I don't just say that to everybody. It's been great doing business with you. Really? Ya tengo barco. Sucker. <laughs> Primero. And don't forget your crew. All y falta la them. tripulación. Tres.
Tres tripulantes necesito. Vale, a ver. Eh, Carla es uno de los tripulantes. Y el... No y el, el entrenador también. Ah, no está. El entrenador está en la isla, sí. Vamos a hablar con Carla primero. You've already got the t-shirt. What do you want now? The governor's been kidnapped! What? That's ridiculous. Oh, no. This looks bad. Very bad. I'm getting a ship and a crew together to go rescue her. Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to regret this, but... Count me in. I'll meet you at the dock. Vale, ya tenemos una de los tripulantes. Just returned from melee, LeChuck and his crew find their old hiding place in the underground rivers of Monkey Island and drop anchor. Captain, sir, I just stopped by to congratulate you on your kidnapping mission. Captain? Captain, are you all right? Never felt better. And how fares our prisoner? Ah, yes, the uh, prisoner. <laughs> We had a little trouble. Trouble! No, 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 nothing to worry about, sir. Everything's under control. She escaped a few times, but we've got her locked up in the brig. No one's getting in or out of there. For your sake, I hope not. With years of planning almost destroyed by my death, I'm not taking any chances now. You took care of Mr. Threepwood then? Guybrush Threepwood will not be a problem. At this very moment, he's twenty feet underwater. Probably bloated up like a fattened pig. His eyes being eaten out by crabs. Fish pecking at his fingers. Kind of makes you wish you were there to watch. Ah, yes, sir. Ugh. Sure does it that. Now, go check on the route. Make sure it's locked up tight. Aye, aye, Captain. Vale, vamos a ir aquí a la isla, que todavía no hubiéramos estado ahí. La isla Hook. Vale, tenemos que llegar al otro lado y para eso tenemos el pollo con la polea en medio. Visitors, who are you? The governor's been kidnapped! What? That's preposterous! Oh, really? 
take a look at this note they left. Oh no. This is horrible! What are we going to do? Podríamos reunir una tripulación que ir en su busca. We get a crew together and sail off after them. What an idea! Now, if we only had a captain. Well, what about me? Ha! You! Ha! 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 That's a good one. Hey, I'm serious. Really? Really? Okay, let's see you prove it. Walk this way. There's something in here that I want to show you. Something horrible. Something so horrible that I stay awake at night just thinking about it. But I don't mean to scare you. I'm sure a big brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. After all, it's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago. Arr, 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 arr. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. Oh, I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. Ha! <laughs> Silly me! I'll let you open this last door yourself. Just let me get out of your way. Wait. <laughs> Getting cold feet? No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. You're supposed to open that little door. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Oh, is that all? Okay, go ahead. If you've got the guts. Lo único que hay que hacer es abrir la puerta. Y hay un loro dentro. Simplemente un loro. Fastidiar, pulsar, acariciar, pinchar. Empujar, frotar, meter, palpar, molestar o fastidiar. I don't believe it. You are a brave man after all. You faced the beast I've feared all these years. You had the guts to do what I never could. I feel like such a coward. I'm not good enough to be on your crew. I'm not even good enough to swab your de 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 eggs. Oh, come on, Mr. Uh, Meathook. Mr. Meathook? You're a big, strong, good looking guy with a great tattoo. I can make a talk. Wanna see? Ha! Uh, maybe later. Anyway, you can swab my decks anytime. Really? Sure. I can still be on your crew. Just pack your stuff and meet me at the dock. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I won't let you down. Hey. Maybe I'll get a chance to show you my whole tattoo routine when we're at sea. Wow, this is sounding better and better all the time. Y solo nos queda un tripulante más, el último. It's just. Wow, it works both ways. That's some chicken. Vale. ¿Quién nos queda? El, el que está encerrado, Otis, que está encerrado en la cárcel. Vamos a salvarlo. Y será el tercer tripulante.
Como vimos al principio del juego, el grog es la sustancia más abrasiva que existe. Así que lo que vamos a hacer... ...es llevarnos todas las jarras que podamos... No sé, aquí no hay ninguna jarra Y llenar una sola con grog This stuff is eating right through the Y salir pitando Ya se está derritiendo la jarra. Usamos el grog con la siguiente jarra. Y con la siguiente... Y ahora que estamos aquí, usamos el grojo a la cerradura. Hey, Gray, a drink. I'm real thirsty. Yikes. Wow. And to think I used to drink that stuff. I'm free. Oh yeah, thanks. If there's anything I can ever do for you. Well, actually, there is something. I'm looking for brave people to join my crew and sail off to Monkey Island with me to rescue the governor. She's been abducted by the fearsome pirate LeChuck and is being held against her will somewhere in his secret hideout. I see. Well, Jess, mmm. <laughs> LeChuck, you say. Well, Jess, Jess, of no, no quiere ir. we must sail to Monkey Island and... <gasps> hey, look behind you, a three-headed monkey! <laughs> I can't believe I fell for that. Otra frase mítica. Pretty good trick, though. <laughs> Buen truco, sí. May I help you? I was just on my way to the governor's mansion. Are you here for the looting? It's a chaos. Yes. Looting sounds like fun now that I'm a pirate and all. And do you have reservations? Una reserva para hacer para el saqueo, para saquear. Reservations for looting? Oh yes, very popular when the governor's away. Chaos would ensue if we didn't have a system. Now, unless you have reservations, you'll have to leave. Why, yes, I do have reservations. And what name would they be under? It's probably under S for Shine Top. Nice try, but we're booked solid for the next five hours. No, no me va a dejar entrar. Esto es una tontería. I'm able to squeeze you in around the two o'clock hour. Would that be okay? Yes, that would be fine. Super. I'll put you down for one to loot the governor's mansion at 2.30. ¿Estará aquí el tendero? Hey, where'd you go? I no se ha enterado todavía de que le he quitado el crédito. Who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake? And when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again. What do you want? Le puedo? No. I think I'd just like to browse. No, no le puedo volver a pedir hey, crédito. This ain't no boutique. Don't take all day. Did you know the governor's been kidnapped? Err... Uh, well, yes, we knew about that. 
Can I interest you in a dream vacation to Monkey Island? Because of this sudden change in local government, I'm prepared to offer you a once-in-a-lifetime price on a cruise to that scenic wonderland, Monkey Island. And the amazing thing about this offer is the price. Absolutely free. All you have to do is help me crew the ship and Island Paradise can be yours. Free. And we might just rescue the governor while we're at it. Uh... Well... The governor could probably take care of herself. And we are sort of busy here. Yeah... I'm sorry, we simply can't go at this time. Recordemos que la tripulación eran tres. Podían haber sido estos tres, pero no. Estos no son... Hey, it's a good thing you showed up. Ten people have offered to buy this baby off me while I've been standing here waiting for you. But I said, no way. I know a guy who's in love with this ship, and it would break his heart to lose it. Am I right? Of course I am. I mean, just look at her. Sleek. Aerodynamic. A buoyant barnacle-covered beauty. I think we're having a real moment here. I've changed my mind. I can't give her up. You can have your money back. How could I sell something so dear? Then again, a deal's a deal, right? Right. Catch you later. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. Enjoy. I'm out of here. Whoops, I almost forgot to give you this free seafaring literature. My gift to you. Just remember where you got it. Stands! Maybe I should have gotten that extended warranty after all. Hey, long time no see. Has venido para unirte a mi tripulación? come to be on my crew? Sí. Hey, I could never pass up a chance to make some easy money. Uh, money? Yeah, we are getting paid for this, right? It's true what I heard about you and the storekeeper. Look, don't start with me, okay? So what's that waterlogged wreck doing out there? How are we going to get our ship in here with that pile of scrap in the way? Where's the cabin boy? I need him to go back to my place and pick up my bags. What's going on here? Where's our ship? Where's our crew? This isn't going to be as easy as I thought.